Lines right for the Doombin Classic. Starters on the platform. He's ready for them. Signal given now. All set. Racing this time, Burrito began a K quick flick showing speed. The Winslow boy Kidman's cave fast away with Delinquent. Vigil is just off the pace, racing on the inside of Crying Game. Then classy fellow Petonk drifting back to second last. And Prussian Blue is last of all. They head up towards the thousand now in the lead at quick flick. Three quarters of a length in front of Ravada and Kidman's Cove. Three deep. Burrito one away fourth on the inside of Delinquent, followed by Vigil. Classy fellow on the inside of Crying Game. Then the Winslow boy covering ground three wide. Petonk eight lengths off the lead as second last. And then Prussian blue into the first bend 800 meters left to go quick flick is the neck in front of Ravada the outside Kidman's Cove one and a half away third then delinquent fifth over on the rails burrito followed by the Winslow boy in between horses vigil then crying game who soon to lose his position there passed by Petonk and classy fella over on the inside and Prussian blue last of all running up towards the home turn Ravada moving a little closer to quick flick there's little between them as they straighten up a length and a half away third Kidman's Cove followed by burrito sticking to the rails in between then classy Follow the Winslow boy and Petonk to the outside. Quick flick and Ravada. They're locked together at the 300. Kidman's Cove coming at the pair of them and Petonk winding up out wide. Ravada, quick flick, quick flick, kicking on the inside just in front of Ravada. Ravada having another crack at him. Kidman's Cove is having a crack at the pair of them on the outside. Kidman's Cove moved up to Ravada. Poked his nose in front and he's won it. It's Kidman's Cove first, Ravada second, quick flick third. Then Delinquent and Petonk dying on his run the last little bit. Classy fellow next home, then Burrito. Followed him by Vigil, the Winslow boy, crying game and Prussian blue last home double twenty dollars when in place number five kidman's cove 780 and 230 one ravada 180 and three quick flick a dollar sixty five kidman's cove 910 270 one ravada 180 and number three quick flick to return one dollar eighty perth coming up soon race cup at queenbian Good on you, Paul, with the bookie boys. I just dropped the betting. Uh, ten to one, uh, Sheer Relief. The favourite, Bly's Bounty. It's a stable mate of Sheer Relief, both trained by Barbara Joseph. Bly's Bounty favourite, six to four. Four to one, Hoist. Five to one, Star of Galaxy. Tens, Handy Gift. He's Daniels at uh, fives. It's in the market. And ten to one, Mighty, Mighty Oigel. So the favourite is the Barbara uh, Joseph trained galloper, Bly's Bounty. Ahead of uh, number four, Hoist. Uh, five, Star of Galaxy. And seven, He's Daniels. Uh, just waiting on Hoist to move along. The rider of his Daniels has dismounted. Sheer relief drawn the inside. Mighty Oigle and Bly's Bounty, Star of Galaxy. Now, uh, his Daniels goes up. Don't forget next Saturday, a big tab meeting at Canberra. Noms close this coming Monday. A Sky Channel meeting, a tab meeting at uh, Canberra next Saturday, uh, May the 18th. And nominations close this coming Monday. Now, the line is just about sent. Hoist the outside runner, racing in the Racing Nations Cup. And Sheer Relief got away well. The stable mate Bly's Bounty second on the outside. Out wide, Hoist moves to third, followed by Star of Galaxy, Mighty Oigle. Up on the outside of that pair was Handy Gift, and dropping out to last was his Daniels. As they settle down, they've got about 1,300 to go as they race up the side. And Bly's Bounty has raced to the lead. Bly's Bounty a length and a half in front of Hoist. A half a length, Sheer Relief, third a length behind those Star of Galaxy. Getting back behind those Mighty Oigle, followed by Handy Gift on the outside. And last of all, as they commence the run down the back was his Daniels they've got about 1100 to go and Bly's Bounty the favourite doing it well a length and a half in front of Hoist keeping in close contact Star of Galaxy goes around the field and takes the leader on now and shortly after Star of Galaxy put the head in front but kicking up on the inside was Bly's Bounty a little between that pair a length or so behind those third Hoist followed by Handy Gift running on a length or so Sheer Relief followed on by Mighty Oigle and two behind those he's Daniels last of all as they leave the back and race up the side Star of Galaxy is the leader Hoist has moved up on the outside, followed by Handy Gift. Still there on the inside was Bly's Bounty, kicking up again to make a line of three. A length or so, Sheer Relief centre field, followed by his Daniels. And uh, Mighty Oigel last of all, they're tightly bunched as they race up towards the turn, 400 ago. And again, Bly's Bounty put the head in front. Star of Galaxy in the centre, followed by Hoist out three wide. Running on was his Daniels, followed by Sheer Relief. And the next one was Mighty Oigel, followed by Handy Gift, but at the 200. And Bly's Bounty has kicked away again now. Bly's Bounty out about a length or so. Trying hard was He's Daniels followed by Star of Galaxy. Uh, drifting off the track. Here comes He's Daniels now. Bly's Bounty taken on by He's Daniels. Or maybe He's Daniels on the outside. Nothing in it though. They're very wide apart. He's Daniels or Bly's Bounty in behind those next. Uh, Mighty Oigle may have got third although Star of Galaxy was prominent. Followed further back to Hoist. And the next one behind those then Sheer Relief and Handy Gift last. Possibly seven getting it there. He's Daniel, six dollars two forty on the act tab, or number three Bly's bounty two eighty and one eighty, and it uh, will be no third dividend. 
Judge calls for the photo. This is desperately close. He's Daniels very wide on the track. It's lunged right on the line. And there's only a lip in this. He's Daniels or Bly's Bounty. Bly's Bounty had it won everywhere bar the last stride. He's Daniels uh, kept drifting off all the way down the straight and has finished out very wide. And that may be in his Daniels' favour, but, uh, oh, it's very close. Judge calls for the photo. Could go either way. He's Daniels or Bly's Bounty. 1.38.46 the time. 1.38.46. I'll send the result of the photo down the line. Good, thanks, Tony. Race number five, Adelaide, in about two minutes. Uh, one Coachwood updates, 5, 10, 2, 20 in favour. Two Magical Storm, eight. Now, seven gets it at uh, Queanbeyan, seven, three, and a further photo. Here's Rod. Again, 4, 10, 150.